My name is Jenny Seide and I'm an astronaut with the Canadian Space Agency. I did my engineering degree back at McGill University. Eventually I had this really cool professor who studied fire and I did some combustion experiments in microgravity which got me interested in fire and space. When I was growing up, Roberta Bondar was really important to me. She was this amazing role model as Canada's first female astronaut, inspiring me to pursue a career in science. I was really fortunate with, with my mom. Even though she's not from a scientific background, she did everything that, that she could to encourage me to look at science subjects and keep exploring. That was really special. I was, <laughs> I was really into rocks when I was little. So I had a spreadsheet, yes. I had a labeling system. I carried around vinegar with me yes. to test whether rocks were limestone, yes. but like everywhere. Jan was like, oh, I'm gonna go collect rocks on Mars. So I held the rocks and we collected, right? Yeah. We collected rocks. That was so wonderful. So just anything to kind of encourage that. And I think I benefited from that enormously. So it wasn't just the role model, but it was also this encouragement I had at home from my mom. Being a role model is very important to me because I'm in a, in a very male-dominated environment. So for my students, try and encourage them and act as a role model if I can. Just to inform and inspire, that's really important to me. You see those sparks, you see that interest, you see that growth. I think every child deserves to live their dream. I truly believe that if you study subjects like science, engineering, technology, mathematics, or medicine, you can earn the skills that you need to become whatever you want, even if what you want is to become an astronaut.